Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle for Saturday the 11th of September 2021. We're moving through the weekend. Time is a ticking away as usual. Um, right, so shall we just jump into our Los Angeles Times Expert Level Puzzle and see what we can see, if indeed we can see anything. certainly can. You can certainly see fours blocking up here like this, four across here, four down here like that, giving us a four there. Uh, see a three blocking down here, so three's in one of these squares, so we'll block up here, and that three blocks there, so three's got to go there. This two stops this from being a two, so two has to go there, and there's one number to get here, I think it's a five, isn't it? So let's put the five in. Sorry for the uh, extended silence. I haven't gone anywhere. I'm just looking, just just looking, like just just browsing or something, you know. Ah, there we go. There's a seven blocking down here and a seven blocking up here and a seven across there. So that's a seven. So seven blocking across here now and seven blocking this square. That's got to be a seven there. Uh, seven blocking up here, so that's a seven there. Seven blocking across here, and another seven blocking across here, and a seven blocking down, so that's a seven to go there. Uh, I think there's one more to get, right? So seven blocking this square. Yeah, there is one more. Seven up here, seven across, and seven across. So, you know, if you've only got one more digit, one more block without a digit that you have in the other eight blocks, then you can always get that one. That's a rule to remember. It will stop you searching for other things. Okay, I've seen an eight blocking across here. And another 8 blocking across here and an 8 blocking down here, giving me an 8 in this square here. Well, I see something. I'm not sure. I'll have to talk talk through it with you, right? Let's talk through it together, shall we? I've got four, eight, and nine in this row, and I've got four, eight, and nine in this row. Three numbers in the top row and the bottom row in this shoot. So four, eight, and nine will have to appear in these squares here, right? So if that's four, eight, and nine, what is missing? Uh, 
I'm seeing something else as well. Okay, so okay, so uh, let's say two two blocks up here, two blocks across here, and two blocks across here. I didn't see that before. Look, there's a two to place there actually. Okay, so two's got to be down here, but it can't be one of these three squares, can it? Because four, eight, and nine. So two is either here or here. Any other information on twos? No, all right, so two is here or here. Four, eight, and nine are along there. So that's two. So that means three will either have to be three is blocked along here. So three could be in one of these two squares. Could be one of these along there. Two, three. Five could be here or here. Actually, six could six is six blocks across here as well, right? Okay, this is four, eight, and nine. So six and five block out this row here. So six and five have to be in this square or this square. So whatever's left is here. Now this is 4, 8 and 9, so this has got to be 2, 3 or 2, 3. Well we've got the 3 blocking here, so that's got to be a 3 and that's got to be a 2. Okay. We've still got our 4, 8 and 9 along here to consider at some point. If this is 5 and 6, this is 5 and 6, we know that that is also 5 and 6. We'll bear that in mind for future reference. Nothing really telling me at the moment, but um, something to just keep in mind. I'm not sure I'm seeing anything else. Um, oh, hold on. What's this? This two blocks this square here, and this two blocks these three squares. We don't have a two in this bottom row yet, so that's got to be a two there. Okay. Listen to those cats. Uh, missing number in this column looks to me like a one or a six. It is indeed. Now 6 says that that can't be a 6, so 6 has got to be here and 1 has got to be there like that. So missing numbers here now, 1 and 3. Does that do anything for us? Does it do anything for you? <laughs> Not really. And missing numbers here are 2 and 5. Again, not really doing anything for us. And missing numbers up here are 9, 8, and 6. Well, we've just got the 6 blocking here, uh, but the 9 and the 8 we know nothing about. So not too much we can say about that even. Okay. So it looks good. You know, this shoot looks good, but we, <laughs> we're not really making progress on it. Um, so we need to... Ah, there we go something nine blocking across here and nine blocking across here so that's a single nine there isn't it so that's good now this nine blocks up here and the eight blocks up here if you remember we had four eight and nine so now this is not eight not nine so that's got to be a four
Um, I see five blocking down here. This isn't. I haven't got anything. Five, five is limited to these squares. I'm still. I'm still chatting to you, dear viewer, to try and discover if we've got anything useful. Five is in one of these squares. Three blocks down here. Um, but it could be. Can't really say anything on that. Uh, four. Oh, okay, so four is up here. Six also blocks down here. That's three. Three. Okay, is this going to give me something here? I've got to think about this. Right, let's consider it. Uh, I've got three, five, and six. Three, five, and six blocking down here, and I've got. There are no three, five, or six uh, placed in this block here, so that means they've got to go in these three squares. The five has got to be here. The three and the six we don't know, but three, five, and six are in here. So what's left has to go here. So what's left has to be one and four, right? Because three, five, and six are in these squares. So the four says you can't be a four. Four must go there. One must go there. That was enjoyable. So 8989 eight, nine, it looks like to me, which would be right, yeah, because 89 in this square of course as well, so 8989, eight, nine, okay, yep, looking good so far. Well, one, two, three, four. There. I don't know if this is going to work out to anything. I haven't got it yet, but I'm just going to talk it through with you again. <laughs> you know, when you're not here, I don't talk it through with nobody. Right? I only talk it with through with you. Six and five are missing from this column. Six and five are blocked from this. These two squares here. Six and five must be in this square and this square. They have to be six and five. Right? Can't be anything else. So whatever's left in this column has to go into these two squares. So that means it's a one and a three, right? Six and five are in these two. One and three must be in these two. And we've got a three already blocking this square here. So three goes there or one goes there. Not an easy puzzle, this one, is it? I'm trying to do. Um, I'm trying to get as far as I possibly can before putting in pencil marks. Um, but uh, there's a lot to think about here. It's not easy, I think. I may have discovered something else, I'm not sure though. Four. I don't know if this is going to help, but I see something right. I'm going to click on this four, and this one, and this four, and this one, and this four, and this one. Okay, because now I'm going to say that this can't be a four or a one. This can't be a 401, or this can't be a 401, we're leaving just two squares that can be. So this square and this square have to be 4 and 1, and it has not proved <laughs> very useful. So, oh, oh, oh dear. <laughs> you never know. You never know when these things are going to work out or not. But 4 or 1 in those two squares. Let's see if there is anything else. Let's go through, count through the rest. 
So if we've got one or four in these two squares, actually I'm gonna I'm gonna give them a color so that I can not click away, right? So they're one or four. Now let's see. So one, two, so three could be here, here, or here. So that's no good. Four, no, five now. Five is not here, but could be here and cannot be here because, hold on, let me see that again. Five blocks across here, right? So five is one of these squares. So this cannot be five, right? Five blocks this square here, no five allowed here. So this cannot be five. This five blocks this square. So this has got to be five. Oh. <laughs> I haven't, I've just given it a color instead of giving it a number. How do I undo the color? Let me see. No, I think that's okay. Right. Right. Now, if you remember, one and four in those two squares. So now maybe we might even be able to get the others. I don't know. Uh, so the other missing numbers will be three and six, right? If these are 1 and 4, or 1 and 4, the missing numbers are 3 and 6, and this 6 says, uh, oh no, sorry, 3 and 6 here or here, 3 or 6, any good? 3 or 6, no, could be 3 or 6, okay, so don't worry about it, can't tell for now. Um, no, don't know. All right, I'm going to um, unhighlight these uh, numbers so that we get back to normal otherwise it would just be um, distracting I think oh look I found a number four blocking up here and four blocking across here I didn't see that before we can place the four here and right across here right from this four and this four and four blocking up here we can place a four there as well and now we can get a four down here, wow. So that means we can get the one, right? Okay, <laughs> one blocking here. Right. Did I do all of that gymnastics, mental gymnastics for nothing? Could I have placed that four and not had to do all of that stuff? <laughs> Made it more difficult for myself. Okay, never mind. It's done now. Right, where to go? Excuse the uh, delay, I am concentrating. Found it, thought there might be something. Three across here, three across here, that's a three we can place now. Okay, this row is lacking a two, but we've got a two here, stopping both of these squares being a two, so two goes there. Finally, we can get our five there. That's gonna give us a five here, and now we're gonna get all these five sixes, or whatever it was, six, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, and this, can we get this? This is not a six now, right? So it's got to be a three, isn't it? Three and six, there are missing numbers in that column, okay. So now six blocks this square, six blocks this square, six is here. Uh, six blocking across this row, that gives us a six in that square there. Uh, 
Uh, I still don't know eight and nine here. Eight, nine, eight, nine here. That's got to be okay. Right. So this says you are not an eight. The missing numbers have to be eight and nine because these two were eight and nine. There's one other square here. There's one other square here. You can see the pattern. You get to know these patterns. All right. So this has to be a nine. This has to be an eight. This has to be a nine, and this has to be an eight. Okay. One number missing here, I uh, don't know what it is though, it's a 9. Okay. And now 9 blocks this square, so 9 goes up there. 8 is there. One number missing at the end of this row, uh, it's a 3 is it? Okay. Fine. This 8 says this square can't be an 8. So we are forced to place an 8 there. 5 is the last number for this block. 5 blocks down here, 5 blocks this square here, so 5 is in that square. One number missing in this row, it's uh, 6 I think. Okay, so 6 blocking this square. Six blocking this square, so six must go there. Oh, we're almost home now. Great, looks like I've done it without pencil marks. Um, it, I, and I did try my best, <laughs> uh, but it's been a struggle, I must admit. It hasn't been easy, uh, and I'm still not quite there yet, but I'm pretty confident I will be able to finish now without pencil marks. There's one number missing in this row, I think it's a five, it certainly is. One number missing up here, one, two, it's a three. Okay, so three must come here. Missing here is a one. This can't be a one now. One must go there. One blocks this square, so one goes there. Missing number here is a two. And the last missing number down here is also a two, I believe. Yes! Okay. That was tough for me to do that without pencil marks, I will admit. Uh, it's probably taken me a lot longer than if I'd used pencil marks, but, um, you know, it's uh, sometimes you can get there without it, I suppose. Okay, thank you very much for joining me for the Los Angeles Times Expert Level Puzzle. I hope you did well yourself, and I hope you are constantly improving in your Sudoku playing. Uh, please come back and join me. There's plenty of Sudoku on this channel of all levels. Bye-bye.